Ned Skyver again with Pine Strike Golf with another feature from the not so terrible town. We're out at beautiful, beautiful Mountain Shadows Golf Club. They just reopened after a massive renovation. It's an executive golf course featuring all par threes that are absolutely breathtaking. And as you can see, that view of Camelback Mountain isn't too shabby. So we're going to employ our towel. Always, every time you have an opportunity to get a little practice in, take your not so terrible bath towel that's sitting in that linen closet and let's put it to use. So the green is tucked down between these mounds, hopefully you can all see. And what I'm going to be doing is laying my towel out, elongated in the path of the swing, setting my toe line and my ball line. So once I've established my pathway and I set the club down and I get in good posture, I'm then going to know essentially where my toe line is simply by folding the towel up. It's not an exact science, it doesn't have to be exact, it's just an accommodation. It gives you a visualization. So now instead of worrying about a sight stake, which in my view is a little too specific, now I really have a runway. I've got something in which I can really take my airplane off in. So again, I've got the whole green working out in front of me. I'm going to move this ball, hopefully a little left to right. And if it didn't go in the hole, it's going to be awfully close. Let's go find out. Okay, well, we just hit that shot to this beautiful par 3 out here at Shadow Mountains. And let's find out what we got. So I'm going to turn the camera around. You can see that I've got a kind of a fun-filled putt coming up here. So let's take a look and see what Blind Strike can produce in a putting stroke, which I promise you is out of this world. Okay, so I'm not going to pull the flagstick out so you guys can see the hole, but clearly with being a new renovated golf course, there's a lot of grass on these greens and it's quite tall, so it's going to be sticky and it's going to be slow, which means that I want a good motion in my putt, but I want to be committed to the putt, even though I see a kind of a hog back and then a little bit of a right to left, but, and the grain is also going to be moving this direction towards the setting sun, so I ignore the hole. And again, just like I had the not-so-terrible towel, I'm going to see my pathway. And when I see my pathway, I'm going to slide that putter into my imaginary blind strike. I'm going to get nice and set up, eyes down through the side hole. I'm going to take it back, and I'm going to make a stroke. Now again, because of the severity of the slope and the amount of grass on there, that was a pretty aggressive stroke. But I want to make a committed stroke. My next putt is going to be about three and a half feet, but it's going to be straight up the hill. So again, find my imaginary path slide my putter under blind strike, look down through the side hole, make my stroke, hold my finish, and you can see darn near hold that one. So again, always come with a plan, always come committed, always the not so terrible towel, and get your blind strike so you can really develop a hell of a short game as well as a putting stroke. And we'll be right back.